morning routine what is going on everybody so here's jason he's um changing myla's diaper because she gets up right and early at 8 30. for no she gets up at 1 4. well in the morning she gets up at 8. so jason gives me a break usually and he does his little daddy daughter time with her my favorite time in the morning probably Definitely for sure. Gives me a good hour break to sleep in since she has been up. I should be waking up. There I am. I'm waking up. Going back to sleep Going right now. back to sleep because she wakes up three times at night still. She's still a newborn. After I give her a kiss, Jason takes her diapers and goes ahead and takes care of the puppies. Zoe is first. She is the alpha female of the house, kind of, not really. And I put their, their water on the porch, give them a little bit of sunlight before they get their breakfast in the morning. They usually get their food separately because they have two different types of food. And they also go in their kennels um, just to give them a closure for them to eat. Usually Millie only eats all of her food, so he just eats throughout the day for some odd reason. Greedy bug. And then I get Cabrilla's coffee going. She usually takes decaf since she's still breastfeeding. And I'll take the caffeinated version. This Keurig is a lifesaver for sure in the for morning. Because sure. it takes like probably one minute to make each cup of coffee. And then I add all the creamer, all the sugars. Um, anybody that takes coffee straight black is a little off to me. I don't understand. Oh my gosh, babe. Um, black coffee is disgusting. And we need we like all our coffee light. Yeah, I like all the creamer and all the sugars. Well, Cabrera takes more sugar than I do sometimes, um, but I do this in the morning. I test it out. It's usually fantastic. And That's then, pretty good. And then I go and give Cabrera hers while she's still breastfeeding. So I'm breastfeeding Myla. She's still exclusively breastfeeding. Um, you can hear her right now. Right, and then. She, we just breastfeed cuddle, and then I'm gonna go ahead and put her a nap right after she breastfeeds. And she she'll be asleep for what, like 15 minutes? Yeah. <laughs> and then she'll wake up. Good using life. those 15 minutes very wisely right now with right. spreading the bed, um, getting the room back together with our rough nights. Um, they're actually not rough. I'm not gonna lie. No, she's pretty easy. She'll she wakes up and then goes straight back to sleep after she eats. Yeah, love waking up in our room because just that natural lighting is truly amazing. I'm gonna go ahead and get ready, drink my coffee, brush my teeth, you with, know, with wash that, my face with that overly aggressive toothbrush. Yes, and um, scrub my face. Um, I usually do three different things while I wash my face because I am experiencing hormonal acne, so I gotta get that cleared up pronto um, as best as I can. I feel like a 12 year old again. Um, it looks way better. Yeah, it's gotten way better. I'm gonna go ahead and do that mom messy bun because there's no point in getting ready. It is and quarantine. And me trying to figure out why it's taking you so long to get right. ready. Um, it just takes me long. I have a lot of hair, so it just takes a while. But we looking good, looking fresh, looking clean. Love it, get in it. Go ahead and do my eyebrows. I don't do my face, I just do my eyebrows during this time because There's like no I point. said, Mila only sleeps for like 15 minutes in the morning. <laughs> Anyone else getting ready before a newborn wakes up is like Russian roulette. And now I'm out here on the porch while she's playing Russian roulette, trying to figure out why Millie wants to play so much this early in the morning. And I usually put some fights in the air, you know, try to dominate the day with my little dance moves. 
15 hair flips before the day keeps the demons away for sure. Um, I wash my face with cold water just what? to probably, <laughs> that's one hair flip, <laughs> probably just to wake myself up with some witch hazel and I just get on with the day. I put my clothes on and then we're out. Myla's in her room getting herself together. Hopefully soon she'll be able to change herself, you know, make her life easier. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> No, so she's getting ready. We don't really put too much clothes on her because obviously she's a newborn, it's quarantine. I usually wash her face, wipe her little tongue off because she did have thrush for a little bit. Um, so I try to take good care of that. And right after we're done with Milo, we go on our family walk in the mornings. Our best time of day as a family, getting that sun in, um, spending some quality time. And yeah, that's really just our morning routine. Yeah, thanks for watching guys. Thanks for watching. Peace.